All right. So, uh, to start off, um, I did some dry runs of uh, of the super bosses that I'm going to be fighting today, and I can definitely beat both of them. And I accidentally killed one, but I had a save just before. But you know, I know I can do it, so that'll be a. Uh, a cinch. I just have. I mean, I just have to get lucky, really. Lucky that he doesn't nuke me when I'm supposed to be attacking. But we'll fight that when we get there. But for now, uh, we're gonna save the super bosses for last. So instead, we're going to do uh, probably in this order: Leviathan, Phoenix, and then Bahamut. And then we'll go fight the super bosses. Sorry, I'm stretching. Because we could have fought Leviathan earlier, but he uh, totally kicked my ass. So I'm going to get some items and counteract him. I can get coral rings that just absorb his tidal wave like it's a bitch. That'll be pretty cool. I have to remember where I fight him, and by remember, I mean look up where he is, because I know he's in one of the underground caves. I know that for sure. History Falls. That's where he is. Oh, yeah, this one. Okay, okay, I know where I'm going. to it. Uh, ignore those for now. I'm just gonna go from the level 60 uh, stuff I have from beating the final boss. And we're just gonna go with that so I don't totally crush these guys. But before we go do that, get those things I mentioned. I need coral rings, and I need flame rings. Because coral rings for tidal wave, and I can only assume flame rings will uh, eat Bahamut's Mega Flare, which will be super helpful. Are you not the merchant? Yeah, coral rings, we'll get three of. Flame rings, get three of. change the setting. One, one sec. Uh, hopefully that's better. You guys won't notice any change, but I will.
a rest. step encounter. Oh my god. Kaboom. Murder this frog. These guys can make me old? What the fuck? Jesus. <laughs> Okay, you know what? 
Okay, dear. Do I have like fine pits enabled? It's kind of funny. This shouldn't be too bad, honestly. Like, it genuinely shouldn't be bad at all. But... Better safe than sorry, I think. Hey, buddy. You look cool. The power of my water is strong enough to wash away all sin and make all things pure. But only those with the strength to fight the void will I award this power. Rapid fire. Forecast. Thundaga. Jesus. He's gonna go down fast. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, that's about right. Sorry, Leviathan, you're very cool. I got a reflect ring. Nice. Leave the summon monster Leviathan. Can I just teleport? I can't. This is fine. I'll just get flushed. Alright. Next stop is the Phoenix Tower. The Phoenix Tower, I think, is like... The way it works is... There's two doors in each floor, and only one of them sends you up, which is annoying at best. But, you know, I'm really strong now, so with any luck, uh, I at least won't die to random encounters. That's the hope, anyways. And I feel like, with a name like the Phoenix, it's probably gonna have fire attacks. So, flame rings. Oh, that's right. Gotta do this.
<laughs> Who is messaging me? My wife. left. Okay. Left. It's friggin' Aerith. Aerith Final Fantasy. Yeah, these enemies aren't gonna give me trouble. So it was left. And... Oh, oh, nice. I feel like Lemire will be weak to Firaga. I think it's just a plant. as you can get. Yeah. Two lefts work, so I'm gonna say right. Oh, what are these? Ah! <laughs> oh my goodness. Give me elixir. Use magic against this thing. Give it an elixir. Oh. <laughs> it's oh, okay. That's super weird. <laughs> Left, right. Don't tell me it's a straight shot. Okay, it's not. Shetty. Left, left, right, left. <laughs> My flame rings. <laughs> nice. Oh. <laughs> well then. <laughs> Nope. 
bender curl. Jesus, that was easy. I think I'm a little high level for this area. But it looks like if you get the wrong side, you just fight a monster. Tower is tall. Behemoth. I know it's a Kuza beast. <laughs> oh god. Phoenix is gonna be a joke. guys. Just get, getting made fun of. Are you there yet? If I did it again. Okay. Uh, 
Ethers on this save. Didn't. I used to do. Okay, hold on to those. Because I'm going to need them at the top of the tower. <laughs> Jeez, how many floors are on this thing? That'll that'll never not be funny. Living liquid flame again. Well, there was liquid flame again. Fire. Happy dough. <laughs> Jeez. Huh? That's not a phoenix. It's here, you. Hear you. Meow. This is the Windrake that saved you? Meow. Oh. I hear you. I hear you. What are you doing? He says he wants to help you. I hear you. You gonna transform into the Phoenix? What the fuck? Here you knew he didn't have much longer to live. It means in the forest when he saved me. See, it seems he came to this tower so he could use the last of his strength to help you. Hear you. Here's gonna be reborn as the Phoenix. I'm calling it. What do you mean, Mother's not going to make it? 
Here, the doctor did his best. Seems the only thing that can cure her now is a wind drake's tongue. Lena! Where are you going with that knife? Certainly you don't mean to. Stop! Okay, right, I'll go. Princess Lena. Kill him and you'll kill the last of the wind drakes. What's more, the queen mother or er, the queen mother always cared deeply for hear you. Will you still cut out his tongue? No. Princess. Your father used to come here every day, just as conflicted as you are now. But perhaps you made the right decision. Mother. Wow. When Drake Hero became a phoenix and entrusted his strength and soul to Lena, saved the summon monster phoenix. Hear you. Thank you. Aww. It's a lot more somber than I thought it would be. Shit. Thought I was gonna fight the phoenix, not have here you die and become the phoenix. That's so sad. Aww. Poor Lena. I like the music in these games. If if it wasn't painfully obvious by how much I sing during, or you know, hum along to the songs in this game. Yo. All right, this place. If you remember, uh, this place was the um, like one of the first dungeons we did. I think it was when we were, uh, it was like just after the ghost ship stuff, I think. Memory serves. I think that, was that when we were going to get the thing for Hear You? The dragon, gr drake grass or whatever it was called? I can't remember. Enemies are gonna be mad easy now. Oh, <laughs> just gonna resist magic. Not enough MP.
Gail the cat. The dead Gail the cat immediately. Holy shit. And sure enough, these guys don't get any experience points. Or, I mean, you know, they do, but, like, do they really? Cockatrice negates holy damage? That's neat. trying to make it so that when I breathe out of my nose, the little white mage doesn't light up. But I don't think that'll be so easy. Do I have that Yeah, I don't know how well that works. Like, Discord has its own suppression, and that's what uh, this sprite is working off of. But, I don't know. Well, we'll see, I guess. But. Come on, Bahamut. I know you're here, bitch. God, he's massive. Big boy. You who have broken the seal, if you can best me in battle, I shall reward you my power. I don't even see a field sprite. Oh shoot, that's what I should have done. Oh well. Whoops. 
he can use Earthshaker. Just in case. Oh, asshole. damage. Oh, this will be fine. Yeah. <laughs> All that time buffing and he only did one attack. He didn't even use Mega Flare. Aww. I guess I'll never know if my flame rings would affect it or not. Oh well. Received the Summon Monster Bahamut. Oh, he didn't have anything to say after that? Damn. Super boss time. Though, admittedly, they won't be very super. Well, maybe Omega will, but that's just because it's Omega. But I think I have the, uh, the strategy for Shinryu down pat. Because Shinryu's whole deal is that he has a lot of magic attacks. Like a lot of magic attacks. What you do is you make it so he can't have magic attacks. By that I mean stuff like the flame ring, which negates ice damage and makes it so you, uh, absorb fire damage. But, I'm going to do this. Because I did grinding off-stream. So I created separate saves for each of the final, final super bosses. So, uh, this one. Yeah, this one is for Shinryu. For this party, they're all level 65 for their equipment. They'll have coral rings, ice shields, and angel robes on. Ice shields uh, absorb ice damage and negate... Or no, no, they just absorb ice damage. And then coral rings absorb water damage and negate fire damage. Um, but... The downside of the coral ring is that it makes you weak to ice attacks, which is where the ice shield comes in because that kind of covers that one weakness. And then angel robes, I believe, negate poison damage as well. So, because Shinryu has poison breath, naturally, as, you know, dragons tend to do, it negates poison and protects against poisoning. And then I gave Lena a sword instead of just her bare fists because um, it'll increase her magic if I ever need to use it. And uh, I don't think she can bare hand while holding a shield, so I decided against that. For abilities, I gave Bert's HP plus 30. Why did I give him HP plus 30?
I guess I did that because... I don't know, actually. That's confusing to me. But I'm gonna equip Scram, because that way I can avoid all the uh, random encounters on the way to the boss. I guess I give him HP plus 30. And then Lena's got Time Magic again, and Rapid Fire. Then Ferris got Dual Cast and White Magic, and Carl has Dual Cast and Black Magic. Same as same old. Uh, also, funny thing, when grinding in this floor uh, to get jobs up, uh, I mastered a lot of jobs. Just because there's an enemy that appears here that drops 1,099 ABP, which is insane. But anyways. One fix the same. <laughs> it's it's kind of funny. I must have given him HP plus area because I don't have anything else I could really give him. Give him first strike. Get that little chance of uh, getting a preemptive attack. And all that's left is to pray for good RNG. him with magic. Oh, right. I forgot about that. Holy magic heals him. That's why Bart's has the Shura and not Excalibur. <laughs> Oops. I'm smart. Oh, and there's Tidal Wave, which would have killed me if I didn't have Coral Rings. Oh, Roulette, though. Oh, it missed! Where's the move that... There we go. Let's just do that. I have time to think. Oh, I don't got anything else for her to do. does nothing because of the coral ring. <laughs> kind of insane, honestly. Ooh, crit. about is Maelstrom. Yeah, even that doesn't do much. Ooh. That's a first. I've never seen it use Mighty Guard before. Can I dispel that? I wonder. Oh. <laughs> yeah. Okay. <laughs> I 
I guess we'll never know. <laughs> Dragon Seal. It's contained Ragnarok. I think that's the ultimate sword. 140, yeah. Sword engraved with the runes of the gods. Damn. Dragon Seal, signifying the valor of one who has slain the strongest of dragons. God, that's a cool item. What does it do, though? Dragon Seal. Let's look it up. Uh, oh, it serves no purpose. It's just a trophy. Awesome. so many times. might take a few tries actually just because of the RNG of it because he has a nice 30% chance of just removing me from battle which is annoying but for these guys Bartz and Lena both have rapid fire and spell blade because they're going to be our main damage dealers. And then Ferris and Kryl both have white magic, and Kryl also has time magic just for haste. And for equipment-wise, they're all mostly whatever, uh, especially these two, just because they don't aren't going to be dealing damage. They all have Lamia's Tiara to avoid confusion from Rocket Punch, which it'll be using a lot. And then they all have Flame Ring to avoid, uh, avoid Flamethrower and Atomic Ray. And I think another one, but I can't remember. And then they have black and white robes to increase their magic damage. And before that... I think it can also use Earthshaker. So we're gonna counter that. downside of everyone wearing the Lamia tiara is that Ferris and Kryl don't have reduced MP. That's its own thing. But we'll deal with that when we get there. We both do Thundaga because Omega is weak to lightning. But because it has the reflect up, no magic attacks can get it, so we have to spellblade it.
<laughs> Funny seeing that. I should be dual casting protect instead. Because this is going to create a lot of counterattacks. Like a lot of counterattacks. <laughs> but I do a ton of damage. Rocket punch. And circle. Ooh, it missed. Lucky. So Encircle would bring the target party member out of battle, and the only way to uh, undo it is to use Return and restart the entire battle. Which is annoying. Miss. Uh oh. Oh, never mind, it's fine. Lucky. Oh, unlucky. <laughs> Very unlucky. <laughs> uh. Yeah, I wasn't expecting this one to, uh... Really? Unlucky. Very unlucky. the counterattacks. No! You're kidding. That is so incredibly unlucky. At least he didn't open up a blaster that time. Oops, that was a single cast. not kill though. But it could be worse. <laughs> Don't encircle Barts. Or Ferris. Ooh. Not out of the woods yet though.
search. Cast Arise and then Kiraga. Hope I don't get encircled. Oh, there we go. I beat the RNG. The random number. Uh, no, there's nothing that comes out of that. Random number bastard, the RNB. And the Omega badge. Granted, they're on separate. The hell is this? I hope that was just Omega exploding, because what the fuck? Omega badge, recognizing wisdom, strength, and courage surpassing that of the ancients. Nice. Right then. Well, <laughs> this is awkward. That was a lot faster than I thought it would be. But I guess an hour is fine for a bonus stream. Yeah, I don't, can't think of anything else I should do. Yeah, no, I got nothing. Anyways. So I guess I'll just end stream. And actually, I added something new to the end stream screen that I think is a really, really fun. jingle that plays when you uh when you log out in an inn in uh, Final Fantasy 14 and I was like oh that sounds cute I wonder if I can do that then I added something to the BRB screen as well but we'll probably hear that later but that one's probably better than that one so but yeah thanks to the few people who joined in for the bonus stream. Uh, the VOD will be up. I don't know when, honestly. You know what? I can check that right now. Because I have the thing open right here. Bonus stream VOD will be up. Looking like December 14th. But, yeah. Alright, yep. I've, dra I've dragged this on en long enough. Um, tonight, I'm going to be joined by one of my buddies from my 14 guild, named Many. And he's going to be joining me and actually playing along with me uh, in Final Fantasy VI. I'm really excited. Like, Final Fantasy VI is the one of the few Final Fantasy games I actually have played a bit of, but after a certain point, I'm more or less blind, so I'm looking forward to that a lot. Uh, it has my favorite music in the, in the, the entire franchise. But that'll be tonight. So look forward to that. 
Alright, thanks for tuning in. For the people watching the VOD way off in the future, I hope it's snowing. Because I like snow. Anyways. Good night, y'all. Good night, y'all. What? Quarter to two. I'm going insane. I should take a nap before stream. I'm going to... Anyways. See y'all later.